Tilt the camera a few degrees. Center should be there in one more minute. He's coming up. He's pulling up. Neutralize the target now. The unicorn is in the garden. Hit him now! Shit. Sorry, Norwood. Your mumbo jumbo never really worked. But I did enjoy killing his bodyguards. <laughs> I quit. My name is... Hang on, let me get that radio. Mr. Edward Ackers? Yeah? <laughs> That's quite a place you have here. I'm from the Tribune. Uh, my name is Jonathan Salton. I already subscribed to the Tribune. <laughs> oh, no, sir, you don't understand. Um, I'm a reporter. And I'm doing a piece on the criminal justice system. And no one's experience typifies what I'm writing about more than yours. You were the jury foreman at the Whitman trial. How and do I... you know that? That was never supposed to be made public. <sighs> do you mind if 
if I close this so we can have a bit more privacy? Yeah, I do mind. Hey, I don't want to talk to you, especially about that trial. I put that son of a bitch where he belongs. That's all there is to it. <laughs> Not quite all. Never eat spinach quiche after nine o'clock at night. <laughs> anyway, I want to welcome you to the division. I requested you from Oceanside because of your academic background in psychology. I'm assigning you to Inspector Morell. Oh, I'd be honored to work with Inspector Morell. He's been behind a desk for a while, but I want to put him back in the saddle with you. I'm warning you, he has these muscle spasms occasionally, but uh, don't let that freak you out because uh, he's still one of my best detectives. Sir, I'm well aware of his reputation. I'm a little concerned about him, and uh, see, we look after our own here, Richie. Yes, sir. So go pick him up, and uh, the next case up is yours. Thank you, sir. is open because the lock is busted and the super's gonna fix it. What were you doing with that? I was cleaning my weapon. Is there a law against that? In here? In here. The light is good. Look, lady, how can I help you? Sorry, sir. I'm your new partner. God damn it. Hey! Don't play around here! Kids. Boy, never heard nothing. The fuck are you? The fuck, you think you are coming, huh? Come here, sit down. He's in a, he's in a look. If you want me to stash, you can have it. It's right there. Take it, it's right there. Shut up. He's still the sniveling little weasel, I see. Good to see you. I need a place to operate from for a few weeks. This will do. Who are you? Excuse me, sir, but the guys at the precinct must have been jerking me around. They said you caught Whitman by biting his nose off. Didn't do any good. Doctor sewed it right back on. Why'd he do that to his victims? I mean, kill them the way saints were martyred. Whitman was a biblical scholar. Very respected, very, very psychotic. His father was a minister, and he... Uh, he beat his wife for having imagined affairs. He didn't believe his kids were his own kids, and he uh, made their lives a living hell, okay? Mother did nothing to help? No. She was, she was too afraid. So Wibben killed all those women because he hated his mother for not saving him. It's called displacement rage. Sounds like we've been reading the same books. <laughs> I'm interested in people. They're like puzzles. I mean, you, for instance. They, they say you study to be a priest, memorize the Bible word for word how you decoded the chapter and verse quotes we'd been left on the bodies. How you found his hideout. Richie, where's this going? Nowhere, sir. I just... I just wanted you to know I was honored to be your new partner. You'll get over that real soon. <laughs> How you feel? Hey, got my new suit on. I'm ready. Good. 
After you take a look inside, let me know if you really want this case. I need your mind on this one, but if you have the slightest doubt, I'll put you on something else and bring in Wisher and Miller, all right? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay. Did someone move the body? Yeah, the killer. Edward Ackers, retired tool dye worker. Say no more. What the hell are you talking about? He was the patron saint of sailors. He was. He was martyred. They uh, wound his intestines around the windlass. I've never heard of him. Someone want to get me a ladder, please? What does it say? Corinthians. Chapter 15, verse 21. What does it mean? Since by man came death, by man came also the resurrection of the dead. One second. Hello? Sandra Carlo? Yeah. Hi. My name's John Saltzman. I'm a reporter from the Tribune. Um... Y yeah, I, it, that would be fine uh, in a few minutes. John Saltzman? Saltzman, thanks for seeing me on such short notice. I won't take more than a few minutes out of your life. Please, come in. Thank you. You said something about a story about me. Oh, yes. Well, actually, it's a story about the flaws in our criminal justice system. You were a member of the jury in the Whitman trial, and... Oh, my God, no, I don't want to talk about that. All the members of the jury agreed never to go public. It was just such a awful experience we just wanted to forget mm, i understand well sometimes these things do come back to haunt you excuse me i have a lobster on the stove Caffeine makes me edgy. I never would have called you in on it. You don't think I can handle it? Look, all I'm saying is a Whitman copycat should not be your next case. Personally, I think you're wrong. I mean, Whitman never killed a man. I don't, I don't think it's a copycat. I think it's something different. He arranged a body to look like a martyred saint, didn't he? Yeah, but that's M.O. M.O. can change depending on the circumstances. Signature remains static.